Today, we're going to the birthplace of the hamburger. And that's coming up next. Hey guys! Hey it is Joshua and Tone Bone. And we are here in Seymour, Wisconsin. Tell them why Seymour, Wisconsin is a special place, Tony. I'll tell you why. It is the claimed birthplace of the hamburger. Arr. It's the birthplace of the hamburger. Right here, right where we're standing in Seymour, Wisconsin is where the hamburger was invented. And we're here at a park that is all like dedicated. This is holy ground. This is the holy ground of the hamburger. And you get to come with us. And there's a geocache here, a very special multi-cache. So we're gonna walk around. We're gonna see the sights. We're gonna see some burgers. We're gonna see a statue of the person that invented the hamburger. And you get to come with us. Let's go, come on. Tony, yeah. what do you see right now? I see a burger. A burger, no, but just not any burger. Not any burger. No. The world's largest burger. <laughs> or the world's largest grill. And the world's largest grill, actually. I they, think. Tell us about what you're, they're about to see. They actually grill a giant burger here. They do. They grill the world's largest burger here. They have set the record during burger days in August. Uh, what I'm going to be showing you in just a second is the actual, just like the casing of the grill, and on top is just a fantastic sight to see. I don't even want to explain it. Okay, yet. show us now. Let's follow me. So here you are, Tony. Taking a sauna in the world's largest grill. I like it. And there's the burger statue. There's the burger statue. That's where they put the real burger. Tony, this calls for something. Yeah. You're next to a giant grill and a giant burger. I yeah. think we need a burger dance. A burger dance? Tony. Yeah. Where are we now? We're by my dear friend Hamburger Charlie. Hamburger right? Charlie, it is a giant statue. Wow. There he is. There he is. What a gentleman. What, did, what happened? What's the history here? So the legend is, as a 15-year-old, Hamburger Charlie was at the uh, county fair, and he had wonderful meatballs for sale, but he noticed that the fair goers really wanted to walk around and eat, so he smushed his meatball down in between two pieces of bread, started handing them out, called them hamburgers. Invented the hamburger. Invented the hamburger. Right here. Hamburger Charlie, you're, right here on these fairgrounds. You're on the spot. How does it feel? I feel like a magician. I don't know why, but I do. <laughs> All right, we need to answer some questions. Yeah. There were two questions. Two. two questions that we had to find out. First question was, how old was Charlie when he... First invented the hamburger. First invented the hamburger, and yeah. we found the answer. And then question number two was what? Uh, how many years did he sell hamburgers? How many years did he sell hamburgers? Yeah. So we did the calculations. We're gonna put it in our GPS and we're gonna see if we can find the cache, the hamburger geocache. Tony, tastiest let's go. geocache ever. All right, so stage two takes us on this big train, a train right here. And I don't know what I think of train caches. There are so many places to look. There are so many places. So many places. So many places to look. We're gonna check out this train, see if we can find the cache and have a burgerlicious great time. All right, so many places to look. Yeah. It told us the east end. This is the east end. This, this is the, the east end. Let's look around. Lots of stuff. Lots of the butt. Thanks the butt for of the, the train. I got it! You got it! What does it mean? It means it's time to dance! Yeah. 